the right lobe is echinormal. There are tiny hypochoic areas which have no clinical or oncological importance. The left lobe has multiple, larger hypochoic lesions. The largest one in the middle third of the lobe is remarkable because of hyperechoic and tranagular figures. These include both linear and granular forms and are located to ventral cystic areas. So, these are back wall cystic figures. Above the left lobe in the neck, there were multiple deeply hypochoic masses. These were ovoid by black regular hilum. Finally, two U.S. guided aspirations are presented. On the second attempt we had to change the direction of the needle in order to target the lesion.